What's up guys and welcome to a brand new video. I'm Ambassador Zimmy and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to recover your Xbox or Microsoft account. Now this video is going to be very very useful to any of you Xbox users out there that want to sign into your Xbox Live account but you forgot your password and you don't have any available contacts that you added onto your account prior that you can send a security code to. Now before I jump into this video I just want to say real quick that if you guys enjoy this video if it helps you out if you learn anything new please make sure to hit that like button and also share this video with your friends and then if you guys never want to miss out on any of my xbox tutorials game trailers or just general xbox news please make sure to hit that subscribe button now with that being said let me go ahead and jump into this video now to actually do this you will need to sign into a web browser you can do this on your xbox one using microsoft edge you can also do it on your smartphone or computer so just go ahead and open up your browser on your device now, the website that you guys are actually going to have to go to is Microsoft.com. I'll be putting a link in the description so you guys can actually just go ahead and click on that. Once you guys are on the website, up here in the top right hand corner, you should see a link that says sign in. Go ahead and click on that link. Now, it's going to be very important that you guys actually know what your email address is for your account. So just go ahead and type in your email address and, and click the next button. Alrighty guys, so the next screen that we're then going to encounter is the enter password screen. So for this, what you guys are then going to need to do is just go ahead and scroll down here and click forgot my password. For this next screen, what we're then going to have to click is just I forgot my password. Just go ahead and highlight that and then hit next. Now this next screen will be the actual first page for recovering your account. So go ahead and make sure that your email is typed in correctly here. And then there will be a little test down here below. It's just basically a test making sure that you're an actual person and not an automated program. So just go ahead and do whatever the test says and then click next. Now some of you guys may see this screen and some of you guys may not. Basically what the website is wanting you to do is select one of these options right here as your alternate contact to send a security code to. Now if you guys recognize one of these alternate contacts, either a phone number or an email, just go ahead and click the check mark and then it will then send you a security code either through to your email or to your phone and then you'll just have to type it in and then you can change your password. For some reason if you don't have these contacts or you do but you don't remember the phone number or you don't remember the password to that email address just go ahead and click I don't have any of these and then click the next button this next screen is going to ask us a contact email address because this is how Microsoft is going to actually communicate to us if you can properly verify that you actually own this account so just go ahead and type in your email and then click the next button Alrighty guys, so this should be the next screen that you guys are going to see. Once you hit next, it will then ask you to type in a code that was sent to your contact email address. So just go ahead and go to your email, find the code and type it in and then click verify. Alrighty guys, so from this page on, it's pretty much self-explanatory. All you have to do is just type in your personal information, click the next button, and then it's gonna ask you a bunch of different questions that only you should know about your Microsoft or Xbox account. So just go ahead and answer all the questions. Try to be as specific as you can and as accurate as you can. I know it is sometimes hard to remember certain things about your account, but just try to be as accurate as possible. After you've answered all of the questions, you will then be allowed to submit this account recovery form. After you submit it, it will take about 24 to 48 hours for a Microsoft employee to make a decision on your account and you will receive an email on your contact email address that, that you provided earlier and it will either say that you were approved and give you a link to reset your password or it will say that you were denied. If you were denied, you can actually come back here and redo the entire form. Just try to be more specific and try to be more accurate and hopefully you will get approved. Guys, that's pretty much gonna be all for this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, if it helped you out, please make sure to like this video. Also, if you guys never wanna miss out on any of my Xbox tutorials, game trailers, or just general Xbox news, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. If any point in this video I wasn't specific enough about anything or if you have any questions about account recovery or just any other random Xbox Live question, please make sure to post all of those down in the comment section below and I will do my best to respond to those as quickly as I can. Like always, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Peace out guys.